Flying Sugar Glider always makes us to have one, right? Yes, it is. It took social media by storm and started a spree of adorable videos all over the internet. And that's how Sugar Glider got the hype of being an adorable pet overnight. But can they really make a good pet or just an internet sensation? Still, there are too many facts that will make you think twice about getting them as household pets. So, in today's video, we'll show you reasons not to get a sugar glider. Petopedia. Sugar gliders may seem like adorable and cuddly pets, but they require specialized care that can be difficult to manage. Before considering getting a sugar glider, make sure to do your research. Sugar gliders need an enclosure that is at least 4 feet high and twice as wide. And of course, the bigger the better. If you have multiple gliders, the space requirements grow exponentially. On top of the space requirement, they need specialized food, drinks, water, protein, fruit, vegetables, vitamins, supplements, pollen, and many more. And that may not be available in your area and can be quite expensive. Additionally, sugar gliders must never be left alone for long periods and are expensive to purchase upfront. Taking all of this into consideration will help ensure that you are able to provide a safe and healthy home for your new pet. When you're buffalo about whether to get a sugar glider or not, the size of their habitat. Sugar gliders need more space than what is typically provided in a large rat or a daegu cage. Instead, they should be housed in an aviary-like environment with plenty of climbing apparatus, as this will help them get enough exercise and stay healthy. It's also important to remember that sugar gliders cannot be kept alone, so the space should be multiplied per glider. For most households, this can be quite challenging due to the vast amount of space required. The minimum cage size should be 24 inches deep by 24 inches wide by 36 inches tall. Ultimately, if you're willing to provide the necessary space for your new pet, then you're well on your way to a happy and healthy companion. Are you considering getting a sugar glider? If so, it is important to know that proper care and treatment of these unique animals should only be performed by a specially trained vet. Sugar gliders are classed as exotic animals because of their special metabolism and small size, making them particularly tricky to take care of. In fact, due to the difficulty of diagnosing and treating them, regular vets who specialize in dogs, cats, or guinea pigs are often unable to provide adequate care. That is why it is so important to find a vet who has experience handling sugar gliders. Not only do they need to be familiar with the animal's specific needs and behaviors, but they also need to know how to diagnose and treat any potential health problems that may arise. It can be hard for even experienced vets to diagnose and treat sugar gliders correctly without causing them distress or harm. So, finding the right vet for your pet is essential. So, if you're thinking about getting a sugar glider as a pet, make sure you do your research first. Watch our video above for more information on what it takes to properly care for a sugar glider before making the commitment. These animals also cannot be left alone for long periods of time due to their highly social nature. As such, you will need to make sure they have plenty of companionship while you're away from home. They require a lot of attention and care, and it's best to have someone with experience look after them when you need to be away. Even if there are specialized professionals available, it is never recommended to leave your pet with someone who does not know them well enough. Health problems can be hard to spot for the untrained eye, making it all the more important that your sugar glider is watched by someone who has experience in caring for these unique creatures. Before deciding to bring a sugar glider into your home, make sure you have arrangements in place for their care while you are away. Last but not least, sugar gliders can be expensive to purchase initially due to the cost of their habitats and food. That's why it's important that owners do their research before deciding if this is the right pet for them. All in all, sugar gliders require more specialized care than some other popular pets. Therefore, dedicated owners should consider all of these factors before taking the plunge. 
With that, our video comes to an end. Hope you have found this video insightful and are going to stay with us for more videos like this. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked this video. Like, comment, and share it with your friends if you find this video useful. Subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for further updates.